hello guys this is Higgy baby and uh, I'm bringing you a search and destroy on scrapyard um if you guys are wondering what the music below is playing or in the background is playing I am listening to one of my favorite bands uh, sleeper star if you don't know of them you should definitely look them up I'm not getting paid or anything to say this but they're really good really talented uh, not well known yet um, but you know I want them to be because they're freaking awesome. They're they're a great band. So you guys should definitely look them up. I'll put a link to their website in the description below at the end of this video. Go check them out. But I guess the main focus of this video is teamwork. Um, after I die right here, I'll talk about it. But I was playing against my friend MLC Stealth today. Uh, I joined one of his lobbies and he was playing with his subscribers, which is a great thing for pe people to do is play with their subscribers. Um, but I was playing with a team, like my team had no communication skills and no teamwork, no map control or anything. Once the round started, it was this exact same map. Once the round started, they would just rush, camp, die. Um, the first round I joined, I actually uh, I had, a attempt, had an attempt of clutching a 1v5. I believe it was a 1v6 one of those because all of them died I was by myself all alone so I had to try and do that uh, I only got to the last guy though and I died because claymores don't want to go off these days but anyways um, when you're playing search and destroy the uh, I don't know the main purpose is to have a good team so you guys can win the point of search and destroy is to win the game win every round uh, it's always nice to 4-0 people because it m makes you feel makes you feel good about you and your team that you guys can work together and accomplish a, cer a certain goal. It's kind of like life, I guess, in a way. It's kind of like a life. Such a good concept. But uh, this is probably gonna be one of my last Call of, Duty, Call of Duty videos until Black Ops. I'm probably gonna have one or two more come out, but then that's about it since it comes out next week. I'm pretty sure. So uh, be looking forward to that. But back to the teamwork thing, uh, I'm playing with a, a full team right now. Uh, I got my buddy MLC Stealth, I got Dibby, Go Home Try Hard, Random BK, Navy Ninja Man, all, all my friends. Um, and we are, now not to sound cocky, but we're a pretty good Search and Destroy team. Uh, it's really rare that people went around on us. Like last round, that was really rare of us to all die. Uh, because uh, we don't try hard, but we're just, I guess, good a good team. We have good teamwork and communication. Uh, if, if we see a guy, we call out where they're at. Uh, if we can't take the shot, we warn our teammates, hey, there's a guy over here. Make sure you carefully walk around this corner or something. We have pulling up claymores and types of equipment that's out. Um, we just work together, and that's the main thing of Search and Destroy. It's a team-oriented game. Do not go into search and destroy. Uh, expect to do what you want and to do good because if you're playing with a team one, they'll get mad at you for being a freaking idiot and running out there and dying. Um, and two, you know that's just not what the game's meant for. It's meant for teamwork. It's a team-based game. Uh, it's not like team. I guess team deathmatch you can call that team-based game, but that's all about hey, I want to get as many kills as I can, you know. Um, and right here, the other team definitely does not have any teamwork. As you see, I take out two guys right there. I heard the sniper miss a shot on me. Take him out. And the last uh, two guys are camping in the back of the map right here behind this rock. Uh, that's good teamwork because they're on offense, right? That's what you do on offense is you camp? No. On offense, your objective is to destroy the bomb. Uh, on defense, we're supposed to defend. But as you see there, we're the ones pretty much attacking them, not even bothering defending our objectives because they're just going to be camping in the back of the map. Uh, that's not what you want in Search and Destroy, that's not the purpose of the game. Uh, so try not to do that. That's a big no-no in the books of uh, Higgy Baby. Uh, I'm not going to judge you for it, but I mean, this is not something you're supposed to do. Um, and right there, that almost killed me. I was about to be really upset that that killed me. Because uh, during this point of the game, I'm like, man, I'm doing actually pretty good. So I might actually uh, post this one on YouTube. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I get the majority of the kills this game. Uh, it's me and my last teammate, uh, CF Marksman, and uh, 
what's gonna happen is this is the last round, so I'm kinda speed this up with the teamwork thing. Um, the other team right here does not have any teamwork. Uh, oh, this is the second last round. Next round, last round, go. But the teamwork on, on this team, I guess, uh, either they didn't have mics, because I, what I do is I start off the game as I mute everyone that's not in my party, because I don't mind listening to them. I don't want to listen to the random people talk trash when they're not winning the game. So I, I just mute them. It keeps me concentrated. Um, and right here, my whole team dies except for me and see it marks me. So uh, what we're going to have to do is try to win the game. Luckily, the guys that we're playing against, I guess are, I guess they're really unexperienced in Search and Destroy because usually in the fourth round, you figure the other team would have a UAV, so you'd want to put on a UAV protection plan kind of thing, like a cold-blooded or something. But clearly they didn't have that, and I could see every one of them like red acne on my screen right now. <laughs> so uh, it's, it's really easy to find people if they're really unexperienced and don't know how to put cold-blooded on the classes. Uh, I'm not using, I'm not repping cold-blooded right now because I feel I don't need it because we're, we've been killing this team the whole time. I doubt they'll have a UAV. Um, and right here, the UAV helps me out. I notice this guy's behind me in that little tunnel, and I go and kill him. Um, so I guess that's my rant on teamwork. Um, be sure to comment, rate, subscribe below. Uh, I have a link for Sleeper Star down the bottom, and check out my latest videos. And uh, yeah, I will definitely talk to you guys in a day or two. I love you so much. Thank you, baby, out. Peace.